Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. Today we are tackling a question everyone's asking. Can you create the same jaw drop in viral level edit in Adobe Premiere Pro and Wondershare Filmora? Using the same footage, same soundtrack and in the same time limit. Spoiler, one of these tools not only matches the Hollywood level quality, but it does it faster, smarter and at a fraction of the cost. For this challenge, I'll create my latest portal style superhero transformation edit. The one that's been blowing up across Instagram and TikTok. We'll use identical raw clips and the same track. No external plugins, no after effects. Just raw editing power in each platform. I've got 45 minutes on Premiere Pro, 45 minutes on Filmora. Ready? Let's do it. First up, Premiere Pro. The industry standard. Syncing the track manually took about 2 minutes already. Then green screen keying with ultra key. I had to adjust spill suppression and matte settings for clean edges. Next, speed ramping with bezier curves. Precise but time consuming. Motion tracking in Premiere Pro without After Effects is clunky. I had to set position keyframes every few frames. Color grading with Leometry is powerful, but fine tuning the cinematic teal orange look ate up more time than I like. We are at 35 minutes and I'm just adding the portal ring effect via imported footage. Quality is top tier but behind schedule. Now Filmora launching in seconds. The AI scene cut automatically sliced my clip to the bead, saving me 5 minutes right away. AI smart cutout removed the background with one click. Edge refined automatically. The speed ramp tool is drag and drop. Seamless and instant preview. I dropped in a built-in portal element. Positioned it and plan a motion tracked it in half a minute. AI color match instantly gave me that cinematic look. I only made minor tweaks. And check this, Filmora's AI music generator created a custom heroic soundtrack that fits my edit perfectly. I'm done with 15 minutes to spare. Now that's amazing. Premiere Pro's version is professional, but you can see the manual tracking is choppy and some speed ramps aren't as smooth. Filmora's version flows seamlessly thanks to those AI tools and built-in assets. And here's a bonus, when I posted both, the Filmora edit got 40% more engagement on my community page. Why did Filmora win? Because it's no longer just a beginner tool, it's an AI powerhouse. AI portrait cutout. Perfect hair details even without the green screen. AI sound effects. Instant whooshes, impacts, ambient sound sync to your footage. AI image generator. Type futuristic portal emblem and get a custom graphic in seconds. Multicam editing. Auto syncs up to 4 angles, ideal for event vlogs. Premiere Pro costs $277 per year. Filmora's annual plan is only $79. That's 70% savings plus AI tools you won't find in Adobe Suite. Filmora now integrates Video 3, so you can generate video clips from a single image. I just uploaded my static superhero pose, typed hero flying over in Neon City, and got a custom 5 second clip ready to edit. The AI Video Enhancer upscales phone footage to crisp 4K resolution. Storyboarding AI Expanded First up, let's go deeper with Storyboarding AI. Beyond generating short list, it now offers two key modes, Narrative Mode and Rhythm Mode. In Narrative Mode, you paste your script and it analyzes center structure and emotional beats, then recommends precise shot durations, a lingering 2 second close up on dialogue, a rapid 0.5 second reaction cut when tension spikes, in rhythm mode, you drop in your music track and it aligns suggested cuts to the song's waveform peaks and tufts. For example, I tested a 90 seconds product teaser. Narrative mode mapped out 7 shots with exact timings. Then rhythm mode, retime those cuts to hit every drum fill. The result was a promo that felt story driven and musically alive. Once the AI shot list appears, you can toggle between modes, adjust each suggestion with a simple slider, or regenerate alternative layouts, all without touching the timeline. This two-pronged approach transforms raw ideas into polished timelines in under 2 minutes. Template Hub Plus – Customizable Smart Templates Next, Template Hub Plus has evolved into a fully customizable smart template platform. Now each template comes with link style packs, collections of effects, transitions, and color grades designed to work together. When you apply a template, Filmora imports the style pack too. Click on style settings and you can swap out any color grade or transition preset across the entire sequence in one click. Let me show you. I selected a cinematic urban template with tinted glows, glitch transitions, and dynamic titles. Under style settings, I swapped the blue-orange LUT for a magenta teal grade and all clips updated instantly. Then I replaced the glitch transitions with smooth whip pants using the same style switch. 
Instead of manually editing 15 keyframes, this mod template applied my new style everywhere. On top of that, Template Hub Plus now supports user macro capture. Record your custom tweaks, like text font changes or overlay positions, then save them as a macro. Next time you apply any template, you can load your macro to reapply your signature adjustments automatically. AI color match and auto grading. Color grading gets supercharged with AI color match and auto grading profiles. Color match analyzes reference footage. In my test, a short film clip graded by Hollywood colorist Stefan Sonnenfeld and applies those exact hues to my raw clips. Now that's amazing. It matches skin tones, shadows, and highlights frame by frame. Then Auto Grading Profiles offers presets tuned for different moods. Golden Hour Warmth, Moody Contrast, Neon Noir, and even Documentary Realism. Here's how I used it. I loaded my green screen hero footage alongside a reference image from a sci-fi blockbuster. With one click, AI Color Match teleported the exact teal orange aesthetics to my timeline. Then I flipped through Auto Grading Profiles. Neon Noir gave me cyberpunk vibes instantly. I only adjusted mid-tone saturation by 5% to fine-tune. What would normally take 10 minutes in your midway took me under 30 seconds. Finally, let's explore AI motion tracking and auto-stabilization. Filmora's motion tracker now supports multi-point tracking. You select up to 5 points on your subject, and the AI tracks them in unison. Great for complex shots like a hero turning or a drone fly-through. You can then attach any element, text, graphics, or overlays to those track points and they'll move naturally in 3D space. Auto-stabilization uses an AI analysis of frame-by-frame -frame shake patterns to apply dynamic warp stabilization. It smooths handheld footage while preserving edges. In my test, I shot a 20-second POV Parker clip. After applying auto-stabilization, the footage was silky smooth. I didn't lose any frame edges or get those weird warps you sometimes see. To use these features, drop your clip on the timeline, click the motion tracker icon, Choose multi-point mode, click each tracking target, and hit analyze. For stabilization, right-click your clip, select video stabilizer, and choose AI dynamic mode. It's that simple. No manual keyframing, no third-party plugins. Look, I love Premiere Pro for big productions, but for you, entrepreneurs, social media creators, and students, Filmora is the smarter pick in 2025. You get Hollywood-level AI assistance without drowning in complex panels. Your time is precious. Filmora gives you back hours per video, so you can focus on creativity, not technical hurdles. The future of editing is AI-driven. Filmora isn't just catching up, it's leading the charge with real-time story automation, emotion-driven cuts, and seamless asset generation. Premiere Pro still has its place, but for viral high-impact content, Filmora is the clear winner. Ready to join the AI editing revolution? Download Filmora using the link in my description. You'll get a free trial with all features unlocked and no watermarks. Try your favorite viral edit challenge and let me know your results. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe for more in-depth tech tutorials, and drop your next viral edit idea in the comments. I'll see you in the next video and happy editing.